The murals in Philadelphia, they tell the stories of where we come from. And I think there's a natural connection between the strength and resilience that you see in those stories with athleticism and running and fitness as well. In the city of brotherly love, the murals are hard to miss. With over 4,000 public works of art, Philadelphia is known as the mural capital of the world. It's the backdrop for Mural Miles, a nonprofit organization that combines fitness and art. Craig Oppenheimer started the group after a run with some friends in 2021. Tell me what you think it is about running and art and fitness. Like, how does it all kind of fit together in your mind? We run past these murals all the time, and we don't stop to take a moment to learn who the artist was or learn the backstory about it. We go on group runs, we visit murals, and it's an art education and fitness experience all in one. I joined Craig and nearly 40 people for my first group run. Let's give it up for Chanel. Every month, members lace up their sneakers, posting their routes and mural stops on social media, inviting all ages, all levels, all for free. I like the opportunity to get to meet some of the artists who create these murals. It's a very diverse group of all different ages. All, everybody is from different places. What is it about running that you love? It makes uh, me feel that I can accomplish things, even though sometimes I think that I cannot do it. With every run, Mural Miles hopes to inspire people through movement and the art that's become unique to the city. For people who aren't from Philadelphia, why are the murals so special to this city? When people are really proud of the murals that are in the neighborhood. They are a catalyst for change. They help make neighborhoods safer um, and more of an enjoyable place to be. Artists like Eric Oakday and David Gwynn are hitting the pavement too. And what does it feel like as an artist to receive this kind of support? You have a sense that people will see it, but you, you're gone. And so to have a group bring 100 people by your work, it's, it's amazing. Running with the group has been incredible. It's just a wonderful community. I'm not a runner and I've never run with a group. So do you think it helps when you're with a group? We're all kind of, you know, around the same purpose. If you're surrounded by people who are doing the exact same thing and are encouraging, it's an amazing opportunity to do something like that. All right, thank you guys for coming out. Today we're gonna run two miles. We're gonna stop at four murals. Before we got started, the group turned the questions on me. Why do you think Philadelphia is the best city in the world? <laughs> Philadelphia is honest. They love hard. This is a very special place, so I wouldn't try to <laughs> The organization is also giving back by curating more art for the city, like this mural that kicked off our run. So this mural is called Equilibrium by Eric Oakday, 2022. Equilibrium is a mural reflecting the theme of movement, both literally and figuratively. Okay, let's run. Yeah. Autumn Revisited by David Gwynn, 2013. You get a cheat stick after this. Convergence by Andrea Grasso, 2021. Finally, our last mural stop. So this is another one of David's murals. Give it up. For these runners, Mural Miles has helped them find more than fitness and art. They found community. This was awesome. Awesome. It was so awesome. We did yeah. a couple of miles. Yeah. Um, mural Miles has a few projects in the works. They're currently raising funds to create a mural that's specifically catered to blind and visually wow. impaired runners so that we can all enjoy it. The mm -hmm. founder told me they're still working on some concepts that, concepts that could involve Braille, perhaps, or a textured wall. Um, and you can learn more about it on their website. I've never run with a group of people before, but there's such a community and camaraderie, different running groups and from the around the city. And the artwork is unbelievable. And then you get a yeah, chance to keep, appreciate. It keeps you going. All of these Thanks murals. Thanks for doing that. It's a great so training good. for your, your marathon. No, more on that to come, for yes. sure. But for you're sure. doing a marathon. We're doing it. Yes, you are. Good for you. Mm -hmm. All right. That was a great story. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.